So, basically, arbitrage trading is a profitable thing and it's not so complicated. You sell on one place while you bought on another one. Now, if you just want a definition, arbitrage is a trading that exploits the tiny differences in price between identical or similar assets in two or more markets. Now, I know that this may sound like a bit too complicated, but let me explain. People are used to do that on AliExpress, for example. So, what they do, they buy something from AliExpress, for example, and then, of course, they sell it on Amazon for a way more money, right? But this includes physical products, right? This is not crypto, but it follows the same principle. Okay, so you buy on one market and then you sell it on another one. Now, what people are also doing is that they, for example, go to Walmart and, for example, there is a discount on, on something, okay? Usually these like things which are like for home, you know, I don't know, cabinets, chairs, grills, whatever, and then they just wait it out, okay? So they just wait it out until that discount is gone, you know? And then they just upload that on Amazon, for example, and they sell it for a lot more money. But as I've told you, this include physical products. And of course, it includes like people being lazy, you know, so they just can't go on AliExpress and they just can't find it themselves. So that's what people are utilizing, people's laziness. But with crypto, of course, it's a whole different story. This will depend on, I don't know, just crypto being crypto, right? So basically, this is how it's going to look like. So this is the person who buys 5,000 worth of Bitcoin on one exchange. Let's use Binance, for example. So then they just use that crypto and, and then they sell it for a higher price on another exchange. For example, Kraken.com or it can be Coinbase. And then what happens, it's the profit of $10 to this person. And now this person goes and buy Bitcoin for this amount that she or he have earned. Now, I know that this sounds like too slow and I don't know, $10 in profit, but this goes in a loop, you know, this goes constantly on the loop. So this person is just doing it over and over again when it sees the difference in prices on all of these exchanges, you know? So that is how it works. But of course, in order to do that, you have to sit at your computer like 24 seven and just click with your mouse going from another exchange to another one and then you just have to i don't know just i don't know a lot of concentration you know you have to do you have to do the work that's why we have these bots that is why we have auto arbitrage trading okay and auto arbitrage trading is a computer program that examines and compares coin prices across exchanges to make automated trades that take advantage of price discrepancies between exchanges you know so people have made the bot some of these you have to pay for but some of these are free to take. Now, what I suggest first is that you go over some research and then you just educate yourself about arbitrage and what it is and how you should approach that. And of course, you gotta have some crypto on your hand or you can just buy some right now. And of course, you gotta know these types of crypto arbitrage strategies. Strategies are different. So first of all, there is cross-exchange arbitrage. Now, this is your usual one. You just go from one to another. For example, you use Kraken and Binance, and then you just cross-exchange these tokens. That is the most usual one and the most simpler one, you know? Then we have spatial arbitrage, which is a bit different. You capitalize on the difference in markets on, for example, Asia markets or USA markets or Europe markets, okay? That's why it's called spatial, okay? So it is on different different platforms based on continents, okay? Because this happens because it is not possible to make all of these prices sync, you know? This is going fast, crypto is changing fast, and if you just take a look at the Bitcoin price of a few of these exchanges right now, you will see the discrepancy in price. For example, let's just take Qcoin, for example. I'm just going to take Bitcoin price. You can see that it is 27.332.8. And on Binance, you can see that it is 27.331. Actually, it just went. So it is 27.331. Okay, so there's a $3 difference on two markets right away. And it happens constantly. Okay, so that's why this bot... Well, of course, for example, in this case, buy certain Bitcoin on Binance because it's a Binance thing. And then it's going to go and sell that on KuCoin. And then it just goes on a loop. But of course, you don't have to stick to Bitcoin. There's a lot of these other like tokens and you can use whichever one of these you want. And there's a lot of these crypto arbitrage bot for trading, you know, so you can, for example, use Pinex, Crypto Hopper, BitsGap, CoinRule, Trality, 
three commas and you have all the information for example you can just go over on research but all of these differ for example on which platform they operate so for example you can see that this Pinex it only has three platforms it has Binance but it has only two more you know so that lowers your possibility of trading and of course possibility of profits you can see for example Bitscap is the hugest one okay so it has a lot of these platforms but of course, you have to pay for Bitscap. You have seven days free trial, while Pinex is free for a lifetime. But you can trade only on these three. But of course, you can make money on these three only because there is a discrepancy between these as well. But of course, if you can use more, if you can invest some money into these, well, of course, you're going to make more. The more you invest, the more money you can get. But of course, not everyone has like, I don't know, thousands of dollars to invest right away on Binance and on these crypto bots. That is why people made something like this. This is called Avi.com. And Avi, well, what it does, it gives you the loan. But it's not your usual loan that you get in your bank. This is called flash loan. Okay, so flash loan means that they will give you, for example, $100,000. But they will give you that only in the case if they see and if they just confirm your transaction. So they will make sure that your trade is going to make money for you. And of course, they will take a fee for just giving you that money. But they will just confirm if that's possible and if it's profitable and then they will just give you that money they will just give you that flash loan and of course it is going to go back immediately to them plus the fee because it's just the way it works smart contracts made it happen and that's how it operates it's a good thing you know all you gotta do is you have to find the right confirmation you have to find the right strategy you have to find the right currency you know so you have to compare the prices and then you can ask for that flash loan and then they will see if you have did it right and of course you get the money and of course as i've told you they will take a fee i don't know how much they will take it depends on the amount of money but of course you can make a profit with this one but you will have to search for that price i think that for automating this for these like crypto bot on binance and all of these you can't take a loan because that's a bot doing the thing but if you take this bot you can make some progress little by little okay so it's gonna go incrementally so one day you will make i don't know five ten dollars another one fifty one hundred it depends on how much of these discrepancies bot can find now i can't tell you take this one or take this one you would just have to go yourself and find a lot of information on these you can see that you have a lot of information on these and you can use whichever one you want of course you can try it out for example you can just try like free trials on all of these and see how much you can make and if you can make money with it but of course, I suggest that you start with Pinex if you are just a beginner because it is going to be free. You know, it has free built-in cryptocurrency arbitrage trading bots. And in this case, you will just take the profits. But of course, you have only three platforms. But the good news is that it has Binance. Okay, so if you were looking for a Binance bot, this is one for you if you are a beginner. But if you are a pro, if you think that you can just allow yourself that you can invest some money into this crypto bot, take a look at these other ones as well. But of course, just watch some reviews, you know, go online and just do the research. If people have like great experience with one or another, just take some caution with it. I heard from some people that Crypto Hopper is a good option and that they just make money with it. And I just heard that you can just set and forget, you know? And I honestly think that if you can allow yourself to get Crypto Hopper, for example, you can just set and forget and that's practically like a passive income of yours. So you don't have to think about it. You don't have to work on it. You don't have to like check it out. Of course, you will get hooked on it and you will just check it out each now and then. But then later, when like the enthusiasm goes away, you will just have an asset of yours, which is just getting you money on a constant basis. You know, you can just forget about it once you just get it all settled up. And of course, what this bot is going to do, it is going to go on this loop as fast as possible. 
No human person can do this as fast as that bot can. And of course, it is just going to go over and over, making profit for you in whichever one of these types you want. I forgot to mention you one more type of crypto arbitrage strategy, and it is this one. It is triangular arbitrage. Now, this is a complicated one because it'll take like three or even four cryptocurrencies and then it will just find the discrepancy. So, for example, it will exchange Bitcoin for Ethereum and then it will sell ETH for Litecoin, for example, and then it will go back to Bitcoin and it just knows how to go and where to look for that profit. You can do it yourself, but this is a complicated one if you want to do it manually. OK, so if you want to do this one, use these bots. It's going to be way easier for you and you don't have to spend a lot of time on it. You know, that's it. So if you think this is for you, Go and check it out. Take these like, I don't know, maybe beginner ones firstly, and then see what's what and if this is going to work out for you. Okay, crypto arbitrage, you can make money on it. Just take caution. I'll catch you.